2010 was another great year for the Red Cross Youth, rich in its community service-based projects, character and leadership development programs and competitions. We have also been greatly involved in both national and international events. Let us look back on past year's activities to see how far the Red Cross Youth has progressed. Community Service-Based Projects As the largest humanitarian organisation in the world, the Red Cross is well placed to lead its members in community service. Some of its events include the Singapore Red Cross Flag Day, Pledge for Humanity Cards, Project Rise and the Project Red Cross Love. National events. As with all other uniform groups in Singapore, the Red Cross Youth also participated in the national events in 2010, such as the Singapore Youth Festival Opening Parade and the National Day Parade. International events. For the first time in RCMA history, we fielded the largest foreign contingent of 70 teachers and students for the Batam Friendship Youth Camp, held from 22nd to 26 June 2010. It was an excellent avenue for our participants to enjoy a very enriching camping experience with other youths from the previous provinces of Indonesia, Thailand, Malaysia, and Germany. The Red Cross Youth reflected the spirit of universality by inviting foreign youth delegates to join our annual Red Cross Youth Challenge. Conducted in the form of a race over four days, our youths were seen racing across Singapore, tackling various obstacles set before them and working together towards the same goal, despite the differences in language, race or religion. Character and Leadership Development Programs We are proud to have conducted character and leadership development programs for all categories of Red Cross Youth members. Linkomania for the primary school students, the Unit Instructors Program for Secondary 2s, Unit Leaders Program for Secondary 3s, the Volunteer Instructor Program for Potential Volunteer Instructors, the Youth Officer Program for Potential Red Cross Youth Officers, and the Unit Officer Program for New Red Cross Youth Teachers. The wide array of programs have always been successfully conducted and improved to provide the best character leadership development for our Red Cross Youth members in line with the Ministry of Education's character building guidelines. Competitions, the second platform for our students to develop strong character and sportsmanship. A total of four competitions were held last year. The Red Cross Youth Arts Festival, the National Food Drug Competition, the Current Affairs Competition and the National First Aid Competition. It was definitely encouraging to see our links participating in the Current Affairs Competition for the first time. They set up booths to display their unit's community service projects and prepared a 5-minute presentation to portray their communication and presentation skills to the judges. Last year's first aid competition saw the inclusion of the outdoor activities element as a criteria. More teachers were seen to be involved in the 10-man team last year. 
to evacuate three casualties over a series of obstacles and create a wooden structure using ropes and poles, all in under 10 minutes. The competition challenged participants in their first aid, casualty evacuation and outdoor skills, as well as the strength and effectiveness of leadership in the team. As we approach the Red Cross Youth 60th anniversary, do look forward to further improvements and new initiatives to the Red Cross Youth. These include the upcoming subject called Exploring Humanitarian Law, which will be infused into the Incentive Batch Scheme, the UNI Channel blog and Facebook, an online platform for Red Cross Youth members to receive fast updates and communicate with one another, and the ASTAR program, a pilot project to assist Red Cross units to achieve the Excellent Unit Award Gold and maintain a culture of excellence. In addition, look out for the annual Red Cross Youth Challenge, which will head back to its roots, Camp Unity, where students will get to experience high rope obstacles and kayaking, just like when it was first created back in 2006. The year 2011 and beyond will definitely be a fruitful one for the Red Cross Youth. With your support, we will be able to provide the best for our primary and secondary school students and develop them to become responsible and resilient global citizens who are leaders in the field of humanitarian work.